like I said before, I had to slow it down because I don't trust melee players. They can pull out the godly like combos like you do. All right. So, so this is GSM Dren versus Terence. Two very well known and very strong melee players. And Reigns and Hawaii. Sheesh. Cool, man. Uh, they both don't play APM that often, but Dren took uh, PC Gamers uh, to the finals against me at one point. Uh, last time I battled Terrence, it was 2 3, and I, I swear I got lucky. Oh! The back air cancelled the super armor off of Yoshi's jump, unable to recover. Just like you guys know, Fogel's back air has one of the highest priorities. Ooh, highest stream, can I get a shout out? <laughs> shout out, press one if you know that we're the highest stream right now for PM right now. Oh, what was I So, Falco's back air and down air has one of the highest pri uh, priorities in this game. Metal feet. Go figure. So it can even break Yoshi's back air. And there's very few things- uh, not back air. Super yeah. armor. It really depends on the percentage though. Yeah, it does. So, uh, just the armor, just in case you guys know, it's called subtractive armor, like I said before. Uh, it's super armor, but after you get knocked out of super armor, the difference of the knockback and the super armor eater gets into Yoshi's knockback. So, if you hit him with a smash, you break his armor, he still doesn't go back far. Well, he has one of the special characteristics of being able to crouch cancel at high percent. Falco is not exactly heavy, but he's also fine. Don't be afraid to cut me out. He's trying to watch a match, he's trying to do some okay. stuff here. Uh, Tried to read a roll, I think, for that down beat. So one of our really good friends, his name is Gavin, uh, I think his tag is Milk. He actually battled Terrence in the last PM tournament. It went to last stop, 100%, last life. I think by then, actually he has the Yoshi experience and Gavin, the, he won our very first PM tournament. He's second place in a lot of it. If you look back at, again, shout out to our YouTube channel, uh, UHM Smash on YouTube. Anything that gets streamed will be on there. Uh, but then, looking back at it, 100% last stop, last life. Terence has tech skill that any Falco wants. Going on. He's a very calculative player, but since he's not melee, the calculations almost lost him. For this matchup though, in melee, Yo should be trying to do a lot of parrying. Parrying is actually removed in this game, because the way mechanics work, parrying in melee was allowed because the hitbox would actually finish once the Yoshi hit shield. But in this game, because the hitbox stays for longer, after you finish parrying, Yoshi still gets by, hit by the hitbox. But then you could still do a perfect shield and you could still get out as long as you can get out of the hitbox. There's uh, a one buffer. Right another thing that Yoshi gets in this game that he did not have in melee is a really good jump out of shield box. Really good jump out of shield. If you see Alms um, place, he bans Final Destination because he can't shield drop. Having that shield drop mechanic, or the shield drop ability, means you're not just stuck in shield. In this game, it doesn't matter if he's on the bottom platform or the top platform, he can still act out of shield. Uh, the bad thing is, Yoshi's grab is still just as large as Mod's grab. Go figure. It's right now going one stock. Good read with the neutral B. Does get really much out of it. The thing about Yoshi is that a lot of his hitboxes and hits go at a really low angle. So that Nair almost has just as much priority as any other move as Falco's. And that's what he excels at, being in the air and having a lot of hitboxes. Okay. Oh, that's odd. So what I see from a lot of Yoshi is that is that Ooh! Oh, that was messed up. Sad days, but the first game goes to Terrence. Oh yeah, Terrence is a gamer tag. Uh, so in semifinals here, if you don't know Yush Mano again, we have five, the bottom five are neutral stages, and the whole two rows are available for counterpick. And in DSR, DSR three out of five, so you, the po there's no banning, unless, okay, unless you guys want a gentleman to do it, but three out of five. Yeah, so this is winners, and, okay. This is winner semis, it's three out of five. So out of 14 stages, if your opponent knows a lot about stages, because everything is neutral. Oh. Everything is everything <laughs> is like not transforming. The Pokemon Stadium 2 is not legal here. Final and Yoshi's are actually coming. We go Smashville, I respect it. Shout out to MDBA up in here. Yo trip, what's up? TSM, what is CLG? Where is the prize pod? You guys want to make it rain on stream? Ooh, side B kills Terrence. I guess one SD to one SD, but let's see if Terrence can pull it back. Now, uh, 
It's funny because Smashville is a very neutral stage. It's like a final destination, but it has a platform bug waiting. It's like a Randall, but it's above, so you have to go high. You can't have that low option. And it's not. It's like good back but let's see. Good back here. Can we break the armor? Air dodge back on stage. Do you get jump? You gotta jump. You gotta jump back. Oh, drop the guard. Yoshi's at 148. I have matches where Yoshi could go up to like 300 and million percent or something. And he goes back. That's his jump. That's his stop. I'm not sure why Yoshi isn't using his up beat because it actually does a really nice pop up. And if you can read the trajectory of the egg, it's almost a guaranteed stop. Yeah, I've seen Jen actually trying to do a lot of Bs. He's not getting exact edges on it. But like personally, his neutral game, his smashing game, and his like jumping out and parrying. It, it's been working out for him. Oh, here comes the pillar. Ooh. Good double jump cancel. Nice. Double jump cancel in this game is beast like. So what happened there was he just double jump cancel out of the air, which gave him a lot of priority over the top. So, uh, one thing I want to do is probably just major cancel out, but you'll see what probably is. Good up there. Prince takes the lead after the first game. After the last game, it kind of looked like Yoshi had a predominant lead. Even if it was, I know I've been saying the whole day, like two stocks, you could bring it back. But like, that match was so going back and forth, but Yoshi looked like he was doing a GameStop trade. If you don't know what a GameStop trade is, a trade that's unfair. <laughs> yeah. Haven't heard that one before. Really, it's, it's pretty common. Uh, so, again, you're gonna see a lot of shield pressure, and when, but Yoshi's shield thing, he can jump out of shield, he's not forced to stay in. Back Good back air. He's missing the armor opportunity. Also uh, for Yoshi's armor, it's lower every single time you damage him. So the higher the percentage, the less armor he has. Absolutely, absolutely. So every percentage counts when you're fighting a Yoshi. But I've when playing as Yoshi, like he still has a buttload of armor, 250%. Oh sorry. Good up air. Rated M routine out of no stream. Sorry about the language, but I don't give a damn. So second me. What I like to do against Yoshi's, I've been seeing a lot, but I just thought like command grabs go through armor. Kevin! The Yoshi players up in here, there's a Yoshi player on stream. Good double jump up air. So the and he takes here. the balloon. I'm like, it's really hype. Too bad like a lot of our main PM players here at UH Monal couldn't make it here, but at least they're technically here physically, they're just not here in the tournament. Ooh, whiff grab, down air pillar, up tilt, pillar. Up smash! Ooh, he, he oh, missed the read on the roll. We got some new age up in here. Yeah, you got me still here, dude. Up smash! I'm getting compliments all day on my commentary, dude. Pick it up. He waited for it. Okay, there was so, the egg. Again, oh, command down grab. smash. Now you're thinking not everyone has a command grab. Command grabs are rare, especially if you come from like. That slow get up. No punish on the slow get up. Nice reverse. On the neutral B. All we need is one tilt. Oh smash! Is that gonna kill? So all we need is a good ledge guard. Again, old stewing. Ooh. Oh, oh double and jump, the cancel, L. suicide. Yeah, Yoshi, whether it's Project Dem or Melee, you're gonna be dying a lot if you're not getting the spot on tech skills. <laughs> but how could you trip their cakey here? Bro, their cakey. Watch out for the streak. They're cagey here. I'm sorry. Oh, that's where you went. Oh, for you guys, comma Aina oh, discount. You can yeah. subscribe to our YouTube for free. Come on, oh, Aina discount. Oh, Dren switched to Doc. Comma Aina discount. Right off the bat with that tech skill shine. Again, we're gonna see Dren's Doc Kamar. He always pulls it off toward the last matches. I think he might be getting cereal up in here. Up oh, tilt. Right now, Terrence is going with 0%. This is going... Nah, he's gonna get hit in. He's gonna get in. Uh, there's a 2%. Oh, okay. And there's a 13. Oh, there's a grab. So, Mario lost part of his chain grab from 3.0 to 3.5 chain. It's done on other characters. Oh, he could not get the double up the wall jump. It's a very... I, it's a very strict timing. But, out of up B, Doc can actually wall jump indefinitely if you have enough walls. Yeah, if you have enough walls. Now the thing about it is like again, Doctor uh, Final Destination has a slope, so you have to hug a little more. 
They made it smaller than 3.0, 3.5. Not really smaller, but they shifted it out for the end of the update. Here comes the pillar. Up tilt. Uh, it's a very thing, like, uh, for those old school melee players, anybody heard of Bob Money? Like, Bob Money was like my hero back then against Dr. Mario. And he just, like, throws the space off the back and then just bear, bear. Like, I can't even bear the bad news. Like, bear the hands of the situation with all these Dr. Mario players. I think we just lost two streamers I for that. I think we lost two streamers for that. I'm a horrible water bender here because I can't control streams. I think we lost another one. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, so back to the match. <laughs> There's the bear. <laughs> Good so kill off a Dren. Now three stop a piece. It's funny because I remember like, anybody had those situations where you have like a black background and people ask you to, can you not wear the black costume kind of thing? I don't like in like melee, but especially in Battlefield. I think in Project M and Brawl, like, the colors are a lot more lighter kind of thing. Very nice. Chocolate rain. It's funny because early early today I was I had to move away from the mic to breathe and I was like that was the first thing that came into my head. Up till back air. It's very standard. If you if you just pop him up man, back air is a good trade that, and it's not even a trade, you take the back air for free with that priority. Dash tag could not get follow up. It was actually a good thing that he did that he used the up tilt in order to try and cover no tap. So if he did cover an option that would give him the most amount of punish, but as long as you cover something, it's better than covering nothing. Yeah. What I like to do is um, just simply like empty hopping, and then like if he does second place, that empty hop will turn into a nair. But if it's not a Ooh, second place, you will So let's see if we can bring it back. Again, these two characters in PM, they hide heavily on projectile play against like most players, but that and is not the air that, off of the shine. I'm not even sure if that's fall though. That that was an upper off the top. That that might have been a box. But you know, you air, I air, we all air. All of it. We're going into Thing about Terrence is that a lot of times people like to play the laser game. Terrence we can actually switch it up. If you play him in melee, he can switch up from being like that laser guy to so, uh, You should really check out that UH Manoa game against me and Terrence. He did like a bunch of really sick long. Ooh, nice down not smash. What's with this? Back to the neutral lady? game. Are you from Reddit? Please, sir. It's raining outside. Don't let me get an umbrella. Ooh, nice laser cancel. Yeah. We're gonna space out. If, if Dr. Mario gets a good, again, being a space you need your glass can, so you can get that kill off early. All Dren needs now is a good gem, but first he has to make it back on stage. This is Dren's winner bracket stock right now. Playing a camp game. Them prescription, dude. No tech. Oh. Grab the grab. That's game. That's game. And that's game. Kill. The moment I saw that grab, it's like, this edge guard, he can't drop. He's not gonna drop it. We're 2 1, guys. 2 1. Let's see it. Gimp denied, dude. Dude, like, you saw that firebird? That firebird. That heartburn, you got a pill on that, man. Overdose and all of here. You gotta pick. Two Pokemon, Pokemon Stadium. Stadium. This is where this is really this is really good. That was a really good option by Terrence using the shine grab instead of trying to shield pressure. Because Dr. Mario can do out of shield options that will cover a lot of the jump options for off the Falco. And if you notice from this game, he's been trying to go for those shield grabs and for the Falco players, you know you're not gonna miss one L cancel. But those shield grabs keeping so much like here. Nice off option. Ooh, little bit. If he kinda of floated a little more to the right, he wanted about that. Can we please make an emote of Terrence's face? I that's think that'd be pretty of, funny. I think it'd be pretty funny. That's the face of focusness. Good for it, Smash. So we're back to 3-3. Three, three. So this could be the last game for Dren in Winner's Bracket, or this could go to a game 5. Now personally, I'm not going to say who I want to battle in Winner's Finals, but I would be hyped for a game 5 
Oh, it'd be super hype. Everyone likes a good game, good match. Holy what? Good catch. So, again, the shield grab. When you see, when you're spacey and you see a guy trying to shield grab, it, it's not safe. Like in melee, you could just keep pressuring the shield until it breaks or until they're buffering a roll. But some people actually have like out of shield options, so when you do mess up, you're gonna get punished. So if you can go for the shield grab, it's guaranteed damage. If you're assuming they're gonna shield your design. Good tech. Uh, oh, nope. Covered the tech in place. Fair. Good combo. Five people on stream who's leaving will miss you. Or maybe you could say log on, give us some views, I don't know. I don't mind. Again, you could catch this all again on YouTube. We play both. We play Project M every month, Melee every month, Smash 4 every month, and Fairly Plenties every month. We have a Smash every single week. Good cover off a of Dren on the top platform. Ooh, jab, 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 jab down, down smash. smash. And the Shout out to the Brawl players when that works, dog. And the accidental air dodge to kill off Dren. Now this is still very possible, like it's not, it's not impossible. Spaces and all. Nice up B, he, went, he didn't go for the ledge, he went straight for the back and he got hit. Alright, bye Strider, good night and have a good day. Good night. Say hi to your crew boys up in there. Good team for the end of the game. We're going to game 5 guys! Now this is... This is Terence's counter pick. The counter pick of 14 stages. If we're gonna go to final destination, I'm gonna be a little bit mad. If you guys weren't here during the first a million matches here, every single counter pick was on final destination on this. Alright, we have Battlefield. So this is a good the pillar if you, if someone tries to kill spam, it's not gonna cover every single uh, approach option. Which Falco Terrence is a good Oh one. no! Oh, he saved him! Oh, and it doesn't even matter, man. He only did it for the cocky. The trip, and then it goes straight into the cave. Sad. Up there. So, I, I think if you like do a dash jump cancel grab, you could do that chain grab. Oh! That the was grab. Good. Are we styling so here? So good. It is just for style, man. That could have. That would have been a stock if that was a moonwalk or a raw back air, but you know, we love seeing the hype up here. Now, Terrence had a magic percentage here. If he keeps this percentage the whole Soft time, he will air. win. Nice Good down air. smash. Down smash, whoops. Hey man, I'm still on adrenaline from my other magic. <laughs> it's all good. Up tilt, try to catch him. It's the magic, it's, a, it's always the magic percentage. Oh, the magic percentage gone. Now can we shift the momentum back? Good in react! On top platform, drop to bottom. Now Terrence is taking the roll. center stage. Now we're all back in neutral. Now the thing about here is that since there's platforms, there's no really And any here's the back. pillar. Ooh. No shine follow-ups. You rather just go for those. Ooh, that short hop would have been a spike. And there's a down smash. Down smash for another star. There's drugs and spikes, man. This is like... I didn't know that combo, the down air into an up air. When you're playing Falco, everything practically combos decently well. Hmm. He just needs to grab that. That's perfect. I don't think the Mario would have made it back either way. No, maybe. Seems a little far. Yeah. Tried to do a down air grab. He was facing the wrong way. Not as much spikes as we usually see from there. Doesn't want me to see my spike joke, that's why. That's what it is. You have a spike joke? I use so much spike jokes. I don't want to hear it. I thought so. I will grab, save grab, grab. Ooh, so the Read laser it? is just stopping him in place. Ooh! Good DI by Dragon. Good DI. I would have like totally missed that DI and just smashed DI towards the Another end. Another thing that changed in this game is Shine does not have invincibility on yeah, frame one. Definitely. Which is why it even No, Shine though does have on frame one. It definitely does. Not in not in Project M. In Project M, Shine does not have invincibility on frame one. No no inv no. Yeah, invincible is not invincible, yeah, definitely. So what happened there was even though yeah. they carried off of the 
shine at the down smash because it removes the invincibility from melee. Ooh, Ooh. another cape. Last stock, last match, let's go for winners finals. Who wins? Goes to winners finals. Other goes to losers semis. Hey, somebody knows who I am. Called me out on stream. Oh, so I was saying, yeah, I, I did say before that uh, Falco does not have any invincibility. Fox and Falco does not have any invincibility in Shine. But Hitbox does come out and Shine on. If you look back at uh, last tournament, Terrence actually outshined. Wait, 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 wait. This is about to get hyped. Back in neutral. Ooh, we're gonna go off in silent up here in this stream. Florida, grab. Yeah, what he's gonna do? Is it back Ooh. here? He thought he was gonna take Roll. a place. Smash the slide off. Back to neutral. Ooh. Neutral air. Oh. Up air. Everyone clench your fists, clench your things that I can't see. Oh! That is game! Terrence advances to winner's finals!